Hello, sports fans! Welcome to the broadcast booth. I'm Jason Aaron Goldberg, and this is Card Collecting Shenanigans. While you're here, hope you'll subscribe. Got a mail day, and this one is a good one. Uh, it really makes me thankful for the awesome YouTube card community. Uh, when I got into doing it, I was inspired by so many people and care packages, and I call them spoils packs. Uh, all that good stuff, and I'm starting to get some from people, and it just, it means, it's so much fun. It makes the hobby so much fun. When I was a kid, I rarely ever traded. I never sent people stuff. The internet and YouTube has made this so easy and fun. It's awesome. It's reinvigorated the hobby, I think. Uh, so I'm going to go through two quick packages, but stay to the end because we're going to play three rounds of pick-a-pack. Why? Because everybody loves a pick-a-pack. Pick up. Uh, first up, uh, this is from Josiah Keen, uh, who made a pledge to the scholarship in exchange for uh, some Mariner cards. Uh, so check the description below for a link to the Clarice Goldberg Scholarship. Big part of my channel is raising money for the scholarship I created in honor uh, of my mom. Uh, so check it out. So I sent him a bunch of cards for a, a a good pledge, a nice little pledge, and he just, out of the kindness of his heart, sent me some of these because he knows I was trying to put the sets together, and awesomely enough, I I don't have at least five of these, so Josiah, I hope you're watching, thanks so much, check that out, the infamous dive into the stands, and it's the blue and the regular, very cool, awesome, 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 awesome. Just beautiful cards. And then I got, he sent me three of these, and uh, I think two of these I don't have. Um, the blue parallel, awesome. I've still never seen a black or a gold, you know, the numbered ones of these. I've never seen one in person. I'm sure they're out there, but I've never seen one. There we go. Very cool. Thank you, Josiah. I really appreciate that, man. Uh, this package is from a man like a hawk. Uh, definitely check out Like a Hot Cards. We have become very fast friends, and we like sending each other stuff. It started with trade talks, and then it was just like, I'm going to give you some cool cards, and you're going to give me some cool cards. Just a great time. So definitely check out Hawk's channel. Uh, great guy, great channel, great content. Uh, first up, we swapped uh, relics from Topps Fire. I swapped him my Jose uh, Wilson Contreras. Sorry, uh, Wilson Contreras. Number 25 out of 50. I always think they're awesome when they're like a nice round kind of number, either one or the last number in the set or right in the middle. Uh, it's very cool. And so I swapped him that for this. And I'm going to steal It Cometh for Eggs nickname, Ozzy Ozzy Albies. Oi, oi, oi. Very cool. I do like Ozzy Albies. I think he's got a bright future, so very awesome to get that uh, from Hawk. And then he, uh, he loves sending me stuff we don't talk about. Um, so I was not expecting things like this out of the, the Allen and Ginter X. I just think it's a hoot. I love the bullpen card card. Very funny. These, uh, are amazing. Uh, as you can tell, I did peek at this because Hawk does a great job of packing and in an effort to save time, I opened it. Uh, so I pre-ripped. Look at that baby. Bench authentic stadium seat. I don't know if it's from the actual perfect game. I'm going to guess no, but wouldn't that be amazing if it was? Just an awesome card. Awesome card. I'm not going to show you what's behind it. Was not expecting this from him. Just, it's, it's making, I really got to step up my next spoils pack to Hawk. Um, just because he's been so awesome with the cards. Look at this, baby. You know who it's going to be. Miguel. And do you believe in miracles? Yes, I do. Miggy two bags. And do can do. A dual relic. Uh, most folks know, and he and Hawk knows, I don't really collect a lot of Panini and stuff because I, I try to avoid the unlicensed stuff. But regardless of what I collect, you know, that just means I don't buy it. It doesn't mean uh, packs of it. It doesn't mean I don't want, you know relics you know any miguel andujar card i can get i want so thank you so much hawk for that this is a little another little pet this is all from like a hawk all from like a hawk 
we were swapping, you know, we we're talking about swapping Allen and Ginter X cards and stuff. So here's what he sent me out of that, out of his breaks. Definitely go watch his Allen and Ginter X breaks. Awesome, Sandy Koufax. That is so sweet. Well, Dellen Batances dances pantsless. The Judge Mini and regular. That's incredible. Let's set those down there. Look at that. Just beautiful. I know some people don't like this particular card of Judge, but you don't see many with the eye black. Uh, so that's very cool. Very cool. Awesome additions to the PC. Also sent me this out of his Topps Fire Break. Hoping uh, the Judge is on his way back. Very cool. Sent me this Jeter out of there. And then... A little more Panini. Panini! I mean, that's just cool stuff. Licensed or not. That's a sweet card right there. I dig that. Very cool. Very, very cool. Thank you, Hawk. You are the man! Can't wait to get my next spoils pack out to you. And this... He was kind enough to send me some stuff for my next big giveaway, which is going to be a Chipper Jones giveaway. I, I put the question out there to people, should it be a Hall of Famer or active player? Uh, people voted for Hall of Famer. Uh, so I got some great Chipper stuff, and he sent me a few cards to include. I don't know if I'm going to include all of these, but uh, we'll see. But here's what he sent. Um, very cool. The Allen and Ginter Blacks are really popping this year. Look at that. Fleer Ultra Rookie. Awesome. Look at that. That's awesome, too. This is what they definitely did not have when I was collecting as a kid. All this foil, rainbow kind of stuff. And they are beautiful. I mean, when you get really well-made ones, it's just awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Look at that. It's even got foil on the back, on the numbers. Very cool. And that's a really cool card. I dig that a lot. I don't even know what that is. Let's see if we can take the tape off. Come on. Come on. Making me work for it. That's a cool... It's thick, too. Uh, oh, it's an SP. Upper Deck SP. Cool. Very cool card. I like that. Neat. So, uh, we'll see how many of those wind up in the giveaway. Uh, it's going to be a good giveaway guaranteed you're gonna have a lot of good stuff in it so uh definitely stay tuned all right let's play pick a pack Woohoo! i was just in a pick a pack mood you know and uh, i thought let's play it because everybody loves a pick a pack and here's what you can see it's like we haven't really got, I, I refill it and all that but round and round she goes where she stops nobody knows Ooh. I was watching, as I mentioned, I think it was Pristine Collectibles. He pulled some amazing stuff out of these fat packs. You know I'm a believer in the fat pack. So let's hope we get something very cool out of this. Make sure our focus is good. Paul DeYoung. Oh. Didi. Didi. Didi, 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 Didi. Gregorius. Eventually, the people are going to get tired of that, but so far, still fun. Biscotti. Oh, Brizzled. That ball was Brizzled. It's a shame we haven't seen more of that commercial. Oh, there's maybe one i got to send to Josiah Keen. Oh, who do we got there? Who do we got there? Oh, I thought maybe it was Miggy. Man. Good base, but that's it. Nothing. No numbered cards. I'll have to go back through and see if any of them have the, like, missing the autograph. I didn't notice the coming attractions of the white back like that, but I don't think there's any of the Venezuela backs. Mmm. All right. Round two. Come on, baby. Let's get something good here. Oh. You know I never pass on some Allen and Ginter. Still working on the set. I think I'm closer to the 2017 than the 2018, but I'll have to give a, a good look at it and see where we are. Ooh, I don't even think there's a mini in there. That's kind of rare. Usually you get 
a mini. Oh, there is a mini in there. Man, these have not been really great packs, have they? These are just really some basic bottom of the barrel kind of base cards. We know we want a hit. Come on, give us a hit. Something good. Oh, okay. All right. We'll get some chrome. We'll rip some chrome over here. Get some sweet out of this. We need a, we need something good. Did see uh, something there. I don't know if it's a refractor or an 83. New Yankee Andrew McCutcheon. More Dustin Fowler. I have so much Dustin Fowler. Does anyone want to trade for Dustin Fowler? Or do you just want some Dustin Fowler? I have so much. If you go back to my Ripping Live recap, I mean, it was just, I, I covered all the Derek, uh, Dustin Fowler crap. All right, one more. I said it was V3. Let's do four. Let's just do four. Come on. Okay. Series one. Let's get us, let's get us a numbered Derek Jeter. I don't see anything extra thick, so another former Yankee, Brandon Drury. Or current Yankee, but not going to play because Miguel Andujar took his job away. Christian Arroyo. Cool, Alex Bregman. Oh, and an 83. Oh, we got a couple good cards in a row there. Let's see what we got. That's cool. You know I'm on the Bregman train. Ooh, I have not seen this card. That's pretty cool. Mmm, like a hawk. That Oh, I might have to relinquish this to your collection. Ooh, that's cool with the two-tone. Not numbered or anything, but... Conforto. Ooh, Arenado. I don't think I have that one either. He's a great player. I think he's got three 30 home run years in a row. This will be his fourth, actually. So we have four hit. Look at that. You can see it. Boom. All right, quick recap just of the the really good stuff. So I can make my thumbnail. Boom. Look at that, baby. That's a beauty right there. I dig that a lot. Cool Alex Bregman. Let's show off... Uh, Those are awesome. Those are just awesome, awesome cards. And let's show off that baby one more time. So uh, before I close out, just wanted to wish my grandmother a happy 92nd birthday. She is in her own little world of dementia now, but uh, only grandma I got, and I love her. Uh, and so happy birthday, grandma, even though you don't know what's going on. Uh, I really appreciate having you around. Uh, so thanks for watching, everybody. Leave a comment below. Slam that like button. Make sure you're subscribed. And I'll see you next time in the broadcast booth.